Hello and welcome to Tameside 60 Second News. I'm Stephen Bridgehouse. Hundreds of people said we'll meet again at Denton's Victoria Park as Tameside celebrated its first ever Veterans Day. The crowd was treated to a performance by Denton Brass Band and Laurie Brown singing from her show a salute to Dame Vera Lynn. Tackling underage drinking moved up a gear this week. An adult caught buying drink for under 18s was given an on-the-spot fixed penalty notice. Tameside TV will be out in Ashton to capture people's memories on Friday. The film will join other memorabilia and help to create a time capsule. It's a key part of the plan for the new market in Ashton, which will open early next year. Youngsters from Two Trees and Edgerton Park High Schools in Denton will take part in a mini European Championship football tournament this week. The inter-school teams are forming friendships ahead of the schools merging in 2010. It's part of Tameside Council's £300 million plan to transform secondary education across the borough. Tickets are now on sale for Hyde Park's splendid weekend at the end of July. The Manchester Camerata will perform music from Swan Lake and Sleeping Beauty, amongst others. There will also be performances by popular tenor John Christos, Alexander O'Neill and the Motown Supreme Queens. Visitors are advised to book early to avoid disappointment. A scheme launched at Duckyfield Town Hall recently was aimed at local plumbers, roofers, electricians and builders to sign up to a good practice charter. The aim is to give residents greater confidence in local traders. And finally, if you want to know what Tameside Council does for you, then check your doormat. The Council's Citizen Newspaper and the A to Z are being delivered to homes across the borough in the next couple of weeks. That's all for now. See you next week.